This is my response video for Coons Trucking IRS 5 tools that you want to hide if they're going to come and steal your stuff. The 5 tools that you, that I want to keep and hide for me. Alright, this is going to be in no particular order. But the first one I like to hide is a snap-on dead blow boxing hammer. You do not have to swing this thing very hard to get the most out of it. I love this thing. This is my second one I ever bought. My first one I lost, sadly, because I left it on, my, on top of my tool truck. And I drove off the customer site without paying too much attention. Second thing, I will keep the Nipex Cobras. Uh, these things are awesome. They can grip like nothing else. They won't slip as long as you put pressure correctly by pushing, pushing this away from you. Or pulling to you just on this lever alone not this one but just this one uh my third thing i would like to hide ratchet wrenches i don't see how any mechanic could be a mechanic without these things the ones i have are just the flat ones i would like some angle ones but you know for what i do these things come in very handy and awesome i really have no problems getting to where I need to go to. Third, what was that? One, two, three. My fourth tool. <laughs> Can't keep count. Number four. I love the whole line of PWZs, but I use number two the most. I have zero through four. I would like to have five, but they cost a little bit too much for now. I, I have more stuff I want to buy. But once again, these replace every single pipe wrench i have ever owned these things are awesome you can get to more tighter spots with them just because the clearance on them is very smaller like half the size of any pipe wrench compared to the size that you can get it to i love these with my whole life once again just push down on this this is all you need to activate the tool as you can see I have uh, one, two, three, and four. And then in this spot, I have zeros. So I like to hide them all, but if I have to just pick one, it would be number two. Then lastly, the most thing I would like to hide is the Power Multi Probe Ultra Circuit Tester because it's three things in the one. If you ever had the opportunity to play with one of these or even look at it, it's very highly recommended for me that you buy one. You can change the tips out to fit voltmeter tips if you don't like the savvy farmy. But what it is, it replaces this test light because it lights up and gives you all the information on this small display they give you. You can see if it's a good ground or a good positive wire. You can shoot, shoot power or ground to whatever you want to test to see if it activates or to see if you need to move wires around. And also it's a, you know, voltmeter all in one. So it's three tools in one. You get your voltmeter, the test light, and then the ability to shoot stuff with power or ground to see if they work. So that's my top five tools I would like to hide from the IRS. If they want to take all my stuff away, or at least, you know, try to, they won't take it without a fight. Well, that's my video, Mr. Coon. Have a good night.